Hey everybody, welcome back to One Room Over Gaming. Okay, today I am back in the world of live streaming, specifically live streaming my escape from Hotel Izanami. And last time we were playing this, we got attacked by a hair monster, and we found the staff room on the second floor, and uh, we got a hammer from there, and then I went back to this room because I got spooked. This is the horse carousel room. I got scared by the mascot. So the only thing in here that I didn't show last time was that there was a note on the floor, and I will show it to you now so is that you know what I know, so we all know some stuff. So let's go in here, and this is Father's Journal, Doll in the Box, which my daughter found. My daughter brought me a doll in a box that she found somewhere. The doll seems to be made of wood, but it is incre it's incredibly disturbing. Where in the world did she find it? This box and the doll that it contained. Okay, now we gotta go. We gotta go before he comes back, because this place is incredibly dangerous. There's a mascot on the loose, and he is... Just a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, what do we got here? There's a pile of rubble. The ceiling must have collapsed. Yes, I know. I'm aware of what the ceiling has done. Okay. So, we tried to go into the staff room and break the- I thought I was going to break the window. I don't think... Okay, that- I'm just looking for... I'm looking for anything the ground has to offer. Wait a minute. Okay, what do we got? Okay. Room... Item... Room 206 key. Okay, good. Uh, so let's just find room 206. Is this it? That'd be cool. That is room 202. Uh, okay, let's go back. To, uh, yeah, we're gonna go back to our room for a hot second. Just in case we need to hide. Even though it's a little out of the way. But I have a map. And if you say map ber berkwards. Oh, lord. Just end me. If you say map backwards, it's, it's Pam. And... I don't have that. Uh, we need to look at items. Map. Select map. And we need floor 2. So we are... We just saw room 202. So we need to go back down the hallway and down a couple of rooms. And not that. Alright, great! What could possibly go wrong? Nothing bad happens here. Just gotta listen for dragging noises. This pig is remarkably stealthy for a big, clunky fucker. You know? You know what I'm saying? You do know what I'm saying. You know why? how I know you know what I'm saying? Because I have been talking to you this whole time, and you have been listening to me. And that's your fault. Okay, so this is room uh, 208, so we gotta go down two more rooms, and hopefully that's probably room 207 right there. So, that would reason that we are at room 206. Okay. Great. A bathroom, to, a little area to hide in. Okay, I'm gonna get out. Uh, but we'll listen. We'll listen really hard. For any kind of murderous things. Oh, just what I needed. A telephone. That's not what I did. That's not what I did. I was aiming... Whoa! Whoa! I was aiming for the phone, yo. Okay, hey, 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 hey. Oh, no, no. No, 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 no. I'm not ready for anything right now. Great. Okay, I just wanted this phone. Oh, oh, oh okay. Okay, hold on. You gotta get the phone in your field of view. Uh, I don't know. I'm saving. Yes. Yes, please. Okay, great. I don't... I'm, I've started trying to learn Japanese. I don't know anything. But I do know that Nana is seven. And I probably even said that wrong. But I'm working on it. Okay, anyway. Um... Which is funny because it's just like the main character's name is Seven. Oh! No! 
Is that a clue? You found Business Journal Glow-in-the-Dark Paint Toys. Let's read about how they were probably made from poisonous paint. There are some words... Oh, so I was getting all ready to read the note. There are some words scrawled on the word... There are some words scrawled on the walls of room 206, written with glow-in-the-dark pen. I think this is mischief of one of the guests, so I'd appreciate it if you could take another look when cleaning it. Those are popular toys these days, but what a nuisance. I'm hoping there's no more mischief after this. You get in your hotel room, and you've had a long day, and all you want to do is rest. And then you... Ah! That's not fair. That's not fair. That he can just jump out at you like that. Oh, he's charging, too. You don't know I'm in here. Right? He can't get it. He doesn't understand doors. He just evaporates into rooms. Okay, great. We're safe. Okay. Uh, so where's this ghost kid gone anyway? Okay, so this, so we've got glow in the dark paint. Uh, but I don't. This strangely hasn't advanced my cause a lot, you know. One of these days, I'm gonna press a power button and the TV will turn on. That is. Wait. Whoa. 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 The sheet of plywood is fixed with a nail. If you have the right tool, you might be able to remove it. Oh, I do have the right tool! Sorry, I just got really excited. I do have the right tool. Come on, come on. This is... She yes, I know. I, I get it. I get it. I know how to remove plywood. I have a hammer, right? That's... I didn't... I... Hammer. Okay, hold on. There's a... I didn't mean to do that. Yes, I know. How do you want me to use this hammer? I'll do it. Just tell me how to... Just tell me how to access the hammer in a way that makes you happy. Okay, there's something here. There's okay. We'll just we'll just back out of it for a second, and we'll just look around and see if there's anything else that I can open. But that should have worked. We'll read this note in the meantime. You found father's memoir, memories with my daughter. It's a lot of father daughter stuff. A lot of journal pages in here. I brought my daughter to Fantasyland. I feel like it's been a while since I've seen my daughter's smiling face. She truly enjoyed herself. Normally I'm so busy that I can't give her any attention at all. I leave her in the care of the school, and then on the weekends she uses the hotel as her playground. I feel really guilty about the hotel employees who play with her for me. So, this dad is possibly, like... Oh, I guess this is the tool. It's gotta be. You found the item chisel. I don't know why the chisel would be, uh, the thing instead of the hammer. But, hey, you know, I'm not gonna complain. What I wanna do is just get this... I just really want to get this, so let's try the chisel and see if that is, that's, that's it, that's great, okay, now I've got a whole other set of issues, most notably, I need numbers, okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Okay, so we saw the glow-in-the-dark paint and a ghost showed up, right? So what if... There's now what looks like a child's drawing on the wall that was blank just a moment ago. Okay, so let's look at this. Let's just stare at it. Um... There's... Kids... Okay. I don't know if this is a clue. Uh, I don't know if that's a clue or not. I don't know if there's any numbers anywhere. No, that just takes me back to the... Okay, so... I need... to know a combo... for... I don't think I have any numbers. I don't think I have any numbers that I've got written down. Unless it's like a... Unless this picture's a clue, but I don't think it is. I, I 
don't think it is. Okay, we got something else here. I just... Oh, okay, there it is. Okay, there it is. 9356. Okay. You really got... When you're looking, you really got to use the, the mechanic. 93... Hold on. Let's go put this in. I hope this damn pig doesn't show up in front of me. That's not what I needed. I'm really not trying to do that. Thank you. Okay, this pig is going to show up. I can feel it in my guts. 9356, I hope, was... Okay, so... Uh, Nine, three, five, six. Room 202! Oh, yeah, we need to go to room 202. Okay, next. Okay. Wow, we've done so much in here all of a sudden. Room 202. That means I can get into the room next to the one a Suza Chan is in. Okay, great. All right, let's go back to the telephone and save, just because I'm feeling pretty proud of myself. Yep, overwrite. Overwrite it all. Overwrite my life. Okay. 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 Room 202. Here I come, room 202. The hell is that sound? I'm not investigating. I'm going back in there. Okay, so he'll probably come in here. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know how how far away he has to be before, like, if there's a distance that he comes at you. I don't know how he moves. We gotta get to room 202. Alright, we're leaving. We just gotta go. Ah! Fuck! God damn, how does he do that? I hope he's not very fast. Get away from me. Is this room 202? It is. Yes! Beat you, you son of a bitch. Get out of here. I felt like foot racing a pig mascot and I won. This guy. This guy. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Proud moment. Okay, we're in room 202. That was a bold move of me, and I won. Okay. Anyway, uh, what I meant to say when I was back in room 206 before I got that code punched in and all that jam and butter. <laughs> Stop fucking around! I'm trying to say things! I don't know what is looking at me. I don't like it. What I was going to say is, when you're playing this game, you really have to use the look mechanic. Like, you have to make her look up and down and kind of comb the walls and stuff for, like, anything. Any little detail. Because that key on the ground, you could miss it so easily. Or just anything. Like, like the wall. If I wouldn't have looked for the little diamond in the blue light up, um, I could have missed that, like, 3,000%. Okay, whatever the fuck you are. It feels as if something is watching you. It looks as if something is watching me. Okay, whatever. I don't have time for you. All right, let's look at the TV. Look all around the TV. Look around, look around, look around, look around. Okay, good. And then you try and turn it on. Nothing happens. You press the TV button, but it won't turn on because uh, it's just not time. It's just not time right now. Okay, we're going to save here. Real quick, just feels like a good idea. Always save if you can. I don't know what you're saying. I want to know what you're saying. I'll f I'll learn what you're saying, so that I can understand better. Okay, now we look at this, and we open. So I I'm, I don't have my hand on my mouse like at all because this kind of this game doesn't really seem to uh, rely on mouse mechanics. Uh, but it, it's more li it's more like your direction your your WASD keys and your um that's a no. Right, let's look at this first. Whatever the hell's over here, there is a circular shaped bed here. How novel. Okay, cool. Well, you know. Okay, now we'll look at the hole because I think this hole could get us into the other room. The wall is only weak at this point. If you find something hard, you might be able to break it. Well, it just so happens that I have. Something called a hammer, not a hamless, because you want to be able to hit more 
and not less when you're holding a hem more. Did you like that joke? Probably not. It's pretty stupid. Anyway, let's use it. Let's bang the wall. Okay, I know about the I know about the bed. I don't care about the bed. Okay, so we need the hammer. I know. Yes, I know. I'm trying. Don't fuck with me. Yes. There we go. I was like, use the hammer! Why does the wall sound like glass breaking? Yes, just a little more and I should be able to break through. Um, I kind of feel a little nervy, though, because there was definitely something staring at me. We gotta talk to Usuzu-chan. Usuzu-chan! Only a little more and I can get you! Boom! That's a sound. That is a sound. What sound is it? Let's find out! Usuzu-chan! Usuzu-chan! What are you doing? Are you plumbing? There's water flooding around my feet all of a sudden. But, but why? Maybe it was the impact of me breaking the wall. Maybe I broke the pipe! I just looked up the screen and it's like a whole bunch of things happening because you've got the phone call and then the character and then you've got Asuza like holding the phone so there's like Asuza on Asuza. It's like the image got mirrored. Anyway, that's not the point. Uh, maybe it was the impact of the breaking wall. It's gushing out! The water is already at my knees! It's just a shot. Get out of there, quick! It's not a fucking watertight room, I don't think. It, it won't open. Why not? Maybe the pressure of the water is presenting, preventing the door from opening? We are not on the Titanic. What should I do? I don't know. Fucking swim. You've got to find a way to get rid of the water! You get a straw, and you put it in your mouth, and then you keep it above the water. And that'll work forever. But how? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not in there with you, dude. I'm not there with you. I can't do these things for you. I need you to help me out a little bit. Please. I don't know either. You don't know? What am I supposed to do by myself? I, can, you, can you breathe by yourself? Can you eat by yourself? How do you get dressed in the morning, Asusa-chan? I don't know. I don't know. Asusa-chan! There must be something... Oh, oh, it is. I see the water now. <laughs> Calm down. Calm down. I'll be here on the phone. <laughs> Live stream my death in Hotel Izanami. You don't do anything. Oh, if you don't do anything now, you're going to drown. Swim! Drown? No, I don't want to drown. She looks mad, and I like that. Use that energy to not drown. I don't want that either. There must be a way. So you have to try. I'm here with you. I believe in you. Right. Pull the plug. Ah, th put your hand in the bathtub and pull the plug. It's still going to take some time to get her. It's still going to take some time to get into her room. I don't think it is. I think we broke, I think we broke the wall. For that, I've got to save her somehow. Just using this video call. How the fuck am I supposed to save her with my phone? STOP STREAMING! It looks like there's a TV in this bathroom. Uh, the water level's getting- you have to do something quick. Okay, uh... Uh, Susu chan just hang on a little longer. Meal, hurry, please. Okay. We gotta think of a way to get her out of there fast. Uh, Susu chan I can see them, some buttons. What are they? Yeah, like I said, just fucking put your hand in the bathtub and pull the water out! Boo! What are these buttons? The paint peeled off the wall, and I can't tell what the buttons are for. Oh, she'll just have to try pushing. I mean, unless there's some kind of cultural barrier that I just do not understand, and believe me, there are many cultural barriers that I do not understand. Specifically, I cannot point in other countries or give thumbs up because those are offensive. But only cool in America. Um, FYI, so don't point at people in any. If you're in America, point freely unless you're pointing at somebody angrily then don't do it but like thumbs up totally cool any other country keep those thumbs tucked in because otherwise you are being an asshole um 
But unless there's like a specific button on the bathtub like that is meant for like flood apartment, which I don't think is useful in anybody's life anywhere. Just push them! Okay, try, try that button first. Can you try pushing the closest button? Okay, just push it. I'm pretty sure they don't have an electrify yourself with the bathtub button. The water level is getting higher. Who's drowning? If you calm down, it's too low. Water is already dangerously close. The water is not even at your neck yet. Let's calm it down, Boo Boo, and just push the buttons. Please hurry up and save me. It must have been the ad water button. Okay, great. So let's try this. Hopefully, the next one is subtract the third button from the wall. Okay. Uh. Oh. Oh, Susan Chan, what's wrong? There's a strange sound. The water is stuck. Oh, shit! Take it easy, that means the buttons for reheating the water. Did you notice any other changes? There's no other change except the water's getting hotter. Okay, good! I guess. Okay, let's just try this button. It's probably the worst button to push. Can you try pressing the farthest button? I'm just hoping. Please let this be the drain the tub button. I turn. <laughs> Fuck! It must be the TV's bath button. Oh, uh, the one TV I turn on. What? Push the second button from the wall. It's got to be the only other button that works. Please let this be the drain the tub button. Great. I found the drain the tub button last. The water is decreasing. You can see your feet again. At least now that there's less water on the floor. Mio, the water volume is going down. Great. Now the water pressure should decrease. What about the door? I'll try. Still, no good. Oh, I guess she has to get rid of more water. Just... Nothing is likely to happen if you press the button again. Okay, okay uh, so we drained... So we know how to lower the water a little bit. We'll turn the TV off. Okay, uh... Nothing is likely to happen even if you press this button again. Okay, so... Is it a puzzle? Okay, can you try pressing that button one more time? No, the water's hot enough already. Please, it's just a chunk. Fine. I don't know. We're gonna warp the. Maybe we're trying to warp the door. Okay. Nothing changed. Oh, it seems like nothing else is gonna happen. Okay, so the buttons are useless now. Okay. Um. The the water's. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, wait. The water is draining out of the bathtub and isn't increasing beyond a certain point. Anymore. Okay. That's probably because most of the water is outside of the tub now. Okay. This is time critical shit. Um. Okay. Let's. There's. I don't. I'm moving the cursor, but. Um. Boy, if I. Okay. I'll turn the TV back on. It looks like there's a TV in this bathroom. Great. Uh, does the TV tell you how to get out of. There's trash blocking the drain. How would I fucking know that? Susan Chan, can you get the trash out of the way? I'll try. Stick your hand in the tub. It's a good idea. I hope this isn't like a tub, uh, dish, a tub sink with a dish disposal, a garbage disposal in it. It's some kind of string came up out of the drain. It seems to be all tangled with trash. Warn her about the hair monsters. Okay, let's pull it out. The overflowing water is draining away. Okay, great. Uh, what is that? That string was tangled up the trash, wasn't it? If you pull it slowly, maybe the water around your feet will drain away. Okay, I'll try! Be careful! Yeah, because this place is dangerous. I didn't... <laughs> well? Yes? The water is draining! Great! I think it's going to be okay. I'll be there right away. Okay! Glad we had this phone call conversation. What a wild ride. Hero! I got the... I got the... Uh, Achievement of hero. Oh, no wonder it sounded like glass breaking. I broke through a wall with like a mirror on the other side. Yay! We got into the room. Mio. Asusa chan. Thank you so much. I was so afraid all alone. Couldn't help myself. Couldn't get through a sandwich on my own if I was if someone put me in front of it and I was starving. If you weren't there, Mio, I could have drowned. It's okay, Asusa-chan. It's going to be okay. I couldn't do anything. I'm sorry for being so useless. I'm sorry, Mio. I forgive you. It's really okay. When we get scared, sometimes we don't think clearly. Asusa-chan, I know, I know. I can't breathe. 
I'm out of breath because I honestly, that was a little scary for me too. I don't understand bathtub buttons. I don't have buttons. I don't have a bathtub. I just have a shower. So if you give me a buttons on a tub, they better have instructions. Oh, sorry. I'm just so happy. Okay, I need to go. Is there a phone in here? Whew, okay, are you calm now? You feel pretty calm. Yeah, I feel a little less on edge now. Good. Wait, you're more of a scaredy cat than I expected. This is not the time to roast her. She was just scared. I can't help it. Scary things are just scary. Yeah, they are. But hey, Mio, whatever you do, don't tell Nana about this. Nana. Don't tell Nana about this. I'm just talking over these girls, I'm sorry. Huh? Why not? You and Nana Chunk have been friends a lot longer. That may be true, but still. Actually, when she came up with this idea, I honestly think she might have already guessed. Somehow, if she realizes that I get scared so easily, I'm going to feel like I lost to her. I hate that. Oh, so this is to save face. Got it. <laughs> Alright, although, knowing Nana-chan, it's probably somewhere around here taking a sneaky photo of us. And I bet you it's at this moment that Nana-chan pops out of the fucking mascot, because she's been doing this the whole time, and it's, she was just trying to scare us by being a pig. A pig mascot. Don't say that, that's exactly something Nana would do. I don't even want to think about it. <laughs> I wonder where Nana-chan could be. Q Nana-chan? Oh yeah! I'll try calling her again. And that's when you realize that the call is coming from inside the house. Ladies, I gotta save this game. Huh? It's not working. Maybe Nana-chan's phone is dead. That's not what I meant. I can't even make a call. Huh, no service. Hey! If you let me go to a telephone, I'll make a call! But I was just able to have a call with you, Mio. What's going on all of a sudden? Is... What about mine? What about mine? What about my phone? You're right. Mine says there's no service here, too. Ah, these damn blackouts. Oh, no. They, it's because they didn't pay their phone bills, either one of them, and they just ended today was the day that they shut off the service. What should we do? This way we'll never get in touch with Nana. Hmm. Our original plan today was to go to the third floor, right? That's true. Wait. You're not saying we should actually go to the third floor. Of course we're going to go to the third floor. There's nothing else to do on the second floor. All the other rooms are locked. I found all the keys. There's a ghost. There was something in the wall watching us. And the flooding is on the second floor. If you rise above the flooding, it can't get to you. Because water is heavy and it goes down thanks to gravity. I.e. we'll be safe on the third floor. Because this hotel's not watertight and the water will drain and not fill. I am! That's where we're more like most likely to find Nanata. And... And you want me to come with you? I mean, you can take your chances in this room that floods randomly. That's what I planned, but... What? Forget it. No, no, no. It's too dangerous. Let's be smart and wait outside. After all, Nana might be outside, too. That's not all. We might be able to get some phone reception outside. I like your logic, but no. We're inside, and we don't have any reception, which means that if Nana-chan is still inside, she'll be in the same boat as us. No reception. That may be true, but... There's no way I'm leaving you, Asusa Chan. Plus, after taking a quick look once, we'll go outside just as you suggested. Yeah, good idea. We'll go up to the third floor, we'll see if we can find Nana. If we can't find Nana, we'll go outside and we'll just see about phone reception then. Because it's not like we're in peril. Why don't you come along with me? You promise you absolutely won't leave me? I didn't leave you. Or maybe I left you. I don't know. There was a, the whole first floor debacle. I went to look at something. The other two left. We got split up. It was spooky pooky. But, I mean, technically... It, not my fault, I don't think. I won't leave you. I'm going to stay right with you. I'll hold your hand. Yes, I promise. You can now switch the playable character. Okay, by pressing R, I... So, if I press R... Yes. What is that? Okay, I don't know... I don't know what that means. Um. So, let's press Z... There is a circular shaped bed here. How novel. That's not what I was after. And you know it. You damn well know it. Okay, is there a phone in here? I wanna I wanna go back through the wall. Oh, okay, I get it. You just go you just go through the wall. Okay. We are going to go to the phone. We are going to save. Yes, I think. Is the answer to your question. Great. Okay. So, that's where we're going to end for right here. Thank you guys for coming back to One Room Over Gaming. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Escape...
live stream escape from hotel izanami gotta throw that live stream in there first this is a fun game i like it it's kind of cool too because the puzzles are a little different because there's like a, a difference in cultures so you know they're not as straightforward as they were if this game was made by somebody in america which is really fun because it challenges my brain parts but it's just fun to see it's just fun to play other kinds of games um so thank you everybody for coming back to one room of gaming thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode and until next time you guys know where i'll be i will be right here one room over playing games for you guys okay i'll see you next time you guys take care bye everyone